So we've got four chicken breasts. Yep, got four little chicken breasts there. And probably, I don't know, 16 of the baby carrots that we're gonna dice up. We've got a stalk of celery and one onion. We'll drop some coals on the Dutch oven table. Got a nice pot of coals here. The goal for the chicken is you're gonna wanna kinda brown it on both sides. So being a 10, I would say we could probably achieve that with uh, eight coals. And then we'll put the remainder on the top of the bake. We're gonna be using our 10 inch. Ready for this, dude? We wanna get this guy nice and warm. All right, man. Get your little oil put in the bottom of this guy. Good and hot, looks like. Ooh, sounds like. Sounds like it. Maybe give it a couple minutes on each side. I'm gonna start chopping some veggies here. If you want, you want to check the chicken. It's been probably three, four minutes maybe. Yeah. On that chicken. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Flip these bad boys. Let's do the same thing like we just did to that side. Okay. And then we'll flip them back over to the original side. So we'll put the lid on and let that bake for about 12 to 14 minutes. Nice. That's time to give these chickens uh, one last turn here. Put the lid on. All right, so it goes about 12 minutes or so. We'll take a look and then start adding veggies and all the good stuff. All right, man, should we uh, take a look at the chicken here? I'd say she's good to go. So we got some liquid down at the bottom. We're just gonna set this over here for a second. You drain about half of that. And then we're gonna add the chicken back into the Dutch oven. We're gonna put it back on the heat. While he's doing that, I'm gonna throw some more coals down underneath there. Which these are almost phased out, but they got a little bit of life. That looks good. Chicken back in, put the celery and the onions in. And we'll kind of just give it a quick stir with all that stuff in there. And I might not use all that celery. That's a lot of celery. All right, so that's all mixed up in there. We gotta put the lid back on for about, what did it say, 20 minutes? It's gonna soften that celery and those onions just a little bit before we start adding the rice and the carrots. You ready for some carrots? Let's toss those in. And then we gotta put some rice. Yep, you got a cup of rice and a cup and three quarter of water. Okay. All right. You ready for the rice? Yeah, then we'll mix that all in there. All in that water, just gonna absorb that liquid and really put the lid back on for another 20 minutes or so. And I say it probably should be done by then, but we'll have to take a look. She sure smells nice. All right. Let's see. Get a little bit of everything. Thickest part of the chicken. Oh man, you don't even have to cut it, it's just falling apart. That's the way you like it, man. Oh yeah, for sure. Super easy, but it's a good one if you want to switch it up. Yeah, it's a filling one, that rice and all those veggies, that chicken that'll fill you up real fast. Get out there and try it. <laughs>